Hello and welcome to this video. Today I'm showing you how I did build some custom guitar picks. Let's get into it. I play guitar since I was 12. I used to play a lot, but then I did stop. I almost did not use it for 15 years, but for the last 6 I came back to it. I did buy new picks, but I found myself using the old ones I did have. I prefer to use the old ones, I don't know why. But I broke one of my vintage picks and I wanted to find a replacement. I tried to find new picks like these ones, but I simply could not find any. The ones I did find were also vintage, but they were very expensive. So I decided to do it myself. I did buy a blank sheet of celluloid film and I did the process by myself. It's a pretty simple process, very easy. You simply use one pick as a reference, you mark it in the celluloid film and you cut it by hand. I decided to do it very slowly so I could avoid mistakes. I used a bit of sandpaper in the end, but you could use it without it. If you are having difficulties in finding the proper pick, if you want to create your custom pick, this is a good process. It is easy and cheap. I recommend to use long scissors as they have long travel to cut and you will need to be steady with your hands. I am not very hard playing on the strings, so I did buy a very thin sheet of celluloid film. It is the same thickness as the vintage pick. If you want to do this process, you should buy the thickness you need. A quick use on the sandpaper and let's test it. Remember, you don't have to do this, this is just to be perfect. If you use a good scissors, they alone do a good job. Mm -hmm. 